Do you remember last year when all these apps were going viral where you would upload photos of yourself and then the AI would turn you into a fairy princess or a beautifully illustrated cartoon or a futuristic space person? Now Meta AI will do that for you. This week, Meta released its flagship Llama 3.1405B model, which the company says is more complex than the existing version of its AI. So far, Meta AI has largely been seen as a nuisance because let's say you're going on Instagram and trying to search literally anything, you'll accidentally just ask Meta AI and you'll end up with information that you didn't need or ask for. But with this Imagine Me feature, Meta's actually making something that people will use and unlike some of the other viral apps, Meta's AI features are free. Lenza AI got popular for its Magic Avatars feature, which got almost 13 million downloads in 11 days when it blew up in December 2022. This started a trend where various AI avatar apps took over the iOS app store charts, but there were also privacy concerns around these apps. For example, if you're uploading 10 photos of yourself for the AI to synthesize and turn you into an astronaut, what happens to these photos after the fact? Does the AI generation happen on device, or are these images being uploaded to a cloud server, and then what happens to them? These concerns don't go away with Meta, but unfortunately, Meta already probably has hundreds of pictures of me going back to the time I was in middle school, so I guess that ship has sailed. Not to mention, in some cases, Meta already is training its AI on our public posts, and unless you live in Europe where there's comprehensive data privacy laws, you really can't do anything about that. Sorry to be a spoil sport. But hey, Mark Zuckerberg made an Instagram reel announcing the feature, showing how Meta AI can imagine him as a gladiator or in a boy band or as a streetwear designer in LA. And as much as I want to be skeptical about how these AI models train on our social media posts without our consent, I did want to try to see what Meta could imagine for me. But alas, the feature is only available in beta so far, so I'll have to wait a little bit longer to find out what I would look like if I were the hero in an action movie.